if I can do that with a piece of clothing or shoes, I'm getting it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how funny I'm going to be today for Jess. My brain is fried, you guys. The scandal, the scandal ball oh. happened on a Thursday, which didn't even give me a weekend because I was, I'm tired because I turned into a troll. All right. <laughs> My Instagram was definitely on fire. I couldn't stop. The troll was activated. Okay. So I'm a little exhausted. I do not know how 50 cent does it. <laughs> I'm exhausted already. <laughs> my mom thought that was funny. I'm about, to, I'm about to give Fofty my IG password and just start sending him names. Like, here's the next one to go after. <laughs> I'm like tired. Mama need a nap. All right, what's my next thing, my love? I have like no bathing suits. I used to have a ton. I don't know what happened. I think I left them at the old house or something. And now he whose name I shall not mention, his new... Whatever she is, is probably rocking them in the backyard like a weirdo. That's fine. <laughs> shade. We <laughs> said shade. Activated. <laughs> Activated for this Amazon Live. <laughs> if she has an aborted mission yet, I think I would have. I would have called it a day. One LA Times article is one thing. Two, I'm out of here. I am waiting for the third. Two strikes, you're out. <laughs> All right, this is the bikini that, that I was adorable. Isn't it so cute? Yes. Here it is. Here's the bottoms. Okay. Sassy says Scandaval. Oh. Evie says, we want the Scandaval tea. You don't think I know why some of y'all are here right now? I know. Um. Here's the deal with that. We have been get obviously, now that it's on Bravo, they've... We have picked cameras back up. That has never happened on Vanderpump Rules. I don't know if it's happened on any other show. Usually you wrap if something happens. After we're done filming, you talk about it at the reunion. This was not like that. This was, we got a phone call, cameras are going back up. We are filming. So because we are filming and adding whatever we may add to season 10, I cannot give you all of the tea that I want to give you. And it's going to be very hard. So if I'm not seeming like myself, it's because I don't do well keeping my mouth shut. <laughs> I just wanna <laughs> and listen to what happened. Can you believe it? <laughs> That's what I wanna do. I also wanna give away the entire season 10. I wanna tell you everything that happened, everything that's coming up, but I, can't. <laughs> this dog doesn't do well when she's muzzled. No, not at all. Um, Len asks, how is Ariana doing? Has Raquel reached out to anyone in the cast? Ariana is moving with the motion of the ocean, you know? Right? She's doing as well as could be expected. Right. Raquel, I have no idea. She obviously hasn't reached out to me or anyone on my side because I was never friends with her. I don't know if she's reached out to anyone else. Um, Maria says, sorry, I know what you're talking about, and please call her Rachel at the reunion. <laughs> this is... By the way, I asked for the podcast what you guys wanted to know about, and... There was not one question that didn't refer to her as Rachel. Here's why I feel like I can't do that. Because my name is Lauren and I go by Lala. But someone pointed out that I didn't like change my name though. Like Lala is just a nickname. Just like Stassi is a nickname for Nastasia. So you guys tell me, am I allowed to call her Rachel to be shady? Or am I kind of being like, well, you changed your name too. I don't know. Y'all let me know. Sydney says, are you going to continue to film with Rachel and Tom or are you guys refusing? Um, stay tuned. All right, let's <laughs> stay tuned. The next vintage rectangle. La la. This chat is going off. Popping off. Let me talk to my friends for a sec. Do it. Caitlin, Lala, I watch VPR just because of you. I love you, girl. You kill it every episode. That means so much to me. 
Thank you. My mom, by the way, has never seen an episode. I was just talking to her about something that happened season six. She didn't know that this was filmed. And she was like, appalled. That happened? I could never get over that. I was like, Lisa, this is what's on the show. Like, (laughs) this is what the show is about. She has no clue. Do you have any clue? None at all. But I get the real version, you know, the real live version. Yeah. So I don't need to tune into TV. (laughs) That's true. That's true. A lot of people are like, I wonder if your mom's proud. I'm like, well... She gets the live version, and she tells me she's proud, so I don't think she'd lie. (laughs) Plus, she thinks I'm funny. You are funny. Right? Yes. See, that's what's bad, though, Mom, is I go on camera, and I act a certain way, and then everyone's, like, appalled, and I'm like, my mom doesn't give me this reaction. I swear (laughs) it's not that bad. If, like, my mom is okay with it, I feel like you guys should be, too. (laughs) Um. Let's see. You've all... Oh, I forgot the rest of the question. You've always kept it real. Keep kicking that word, mama, and give them Lala your queen. In reference to season seven, please tell that Bambi-eyed you-know-what. You did not get all your ice cream scoops. You're not invited to the party. Get out of here and go watch Winnie the Pooh. Oh. <laughs> I need to write that down. You remember that. It's a lot of words. I love it. I will say that. Courtney asks, did you see it coming? You'll see. Mm-hmm. You'll see. Let's just say when he whose name we shall not mention, when his mask fell, everybody's dead. Everybody's dead. I started seeing things from a 30,000 foot view, people. It's not the funnest way to live, but it happens. What do I have next? When will Tom apologize to Ariana? I am not in Tom's head. I don't know what he's thinking. Never liked that guy. And now it feels good to have everyone else feel the same way I do. Evie asks, gotta know, has Sandoval ever hit on you? I would eat that guy up. He would never do that. Takes a... Very special person to put up with all this. (laughs) And I also don't think he would ever do that. Number one, I just don't think that he would be attracted to me like that. Also, I'm the worst person to stroke your ego because I'm too busy stroking my own. And with a narcissist, that doesn't work very well. Like you need to constantly stroke theirs. And the second you don't anymore, they move on to someone who does. What do you think my mom's thinking about right now? I'm just listening to what you said and agreeing. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Good. I love that. (laughs) (laughs) Just listening to everything you're saying and agreeing. Yes. Everyone should do that. (laughs) That's right. Um, We have the printed bikini with cover on Palm Springs. So, guys, I feel like no one tooted my horn enough about this. So, I'm going to ask you guys to do it for me. (laughs) I'm totally kidding. Sheena has a house in Palm Springs. My mom and I have gone to see them with Ocean. Ocean loves it. I absolutely love where her house is. So naturally, I started manifesting. And I said, I want a house in this exact development. And I want it to have the same view as Sheena. Cut to, I want to say two weeks ago, Sheena calls me and says, the house right next door, literally right next door is for sale. I drive down that day. I'm obsessed. I want it. We put the offer in and we got the house in Palm Springs. We are closing, I think, on the 24th. So I've been ordering a lot of things to like keep down. Is it down? I feel like it's over and down, right? Palm Is Springs. It, I thought it was up. Is it not up? Oh my god. No, gosh. I think it's over and a little okay. down. I have no idea. I think it is. So I've been ordering things to keep there so that I don't, I can just literally jump in the car and go. It's only two hours and some change away. This is my Palm Springs dress. And for some reason, I picture myself frolicking on the golf course as I chase my two-year-old around and my mom snaps pictures with the mountain range in the distance. I'm being fabulous. (laughs) Right. Haley asks, how are Katie and Sheena doing? I think everyone is just, Putting things aside, anybody who had differences, everything is put into the background. Um, For the moment. For the moment. You know, while we just rally around our friend. 
Obviously, the reunion is coming up in a couple of weeks where we're going to have to rehash the entire season. This, I feel, will be the hardest reunion we've ever done because usually you kind of feel like you watch and you just get re-triggered, but like your feelings are the same. So you go back in and you rehash things, except you're on a hundred now because you've seen confessionals. This is two people who like, they couldn't be further from like who they pretended to be. I think it's going to be very hard for a lot of my cast to kind of get back into how they felt about these two people before this all happened, if I'm making sense. I'm kind of trying to speak in code a little bit because with everything that's going on, I don't want to hear from Bravo today. I just kind of want to like hide in the distance. You wouldn't know if I watched my Instagram, but I did decide today that I'm disengaging. My mom told me I should. My mom said, I think it's time to stop. <laughs> Look at her face. She does intervene when she needs. She's like, knocking on the door as I'm doing another video law I think we've I think we've hit it's that time intervention we got to be quiet no more Instagram <laughs> stories um happy mom zero one says she is stupid to stick with him you said it not me <laughs> Susan asked did Sheena hit her um I was never told that story that seems to be what's circling I've talked to Sheena that never came up to me um, Megan asks thoughts on Tom's post. Um, my thoughts are tell us you're a narcissist without telling us you're a narcissist. It's just so textbook to me. I'm like, of course, of course, and of course, instead of your, you put your, that was the most annoying. I'm like, really? You can't even like type out the other letters. You're putting you are. <sighs> So annoying. All right, my new friends, Demarie Constable, my soulmate. Um, Isis asked, are Kristen, Britt, Stassi, and Jax coming back for this? Um, you guys, everything is changing every single day. I have no idea. I'm just sitting here like, what's going on? Things that I never in a million years would have thought would happen are happening. So stay tuned. I have no idea. This is like the craziest. How many days has it been? Just Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, five. five. Numbers are not my strong suit. <laughs> Just ask my mom. It's been the craziest five days. Um, Sianna asks, do you know of anyone who is team Sandoval? No. Maybe Schwartz. I tried to tell y'all. He's weak. I said it first. Did I not? I said it first, Jessica. Did I not? You said it first. I did. <laughs> Haley, how are you holding up? And where is Daryl? Oh. <laughs> Daryl. Send it to Daryl. <laughs> Daryl. I mean, I didn't realize that that was going to be something that people thought was really funny. Daryl's a legend. Daryl is a legend. I love him. <laughs> He's just in his office. I get a phone call from a part of my team. I know that sounds lame, but they were like, La, please allow Daryl to have like a peaceful work day. And I was like, fine, I'll delete it. But then other people thought it was really funny. And I was like, I'm reposting it. <laughs> yeah, I did. Because it was funny. And I was, I used a filter on the video because I looked so tired. I literally took off my blackout mask, looked into my emails and was like, <laughs> what is this? That's not what I want to wake up to. Come on now. Send it to Daryl. <laughs> Sarah asks, have you chosen your reunion outfit? I sent my options out. I have one that is my favorite and it is amazing. Is it not amazing, Jess? It's do you, perfect. Do you co-sign on it? I co-sign on all of them, but yes. All right, I love that. Okay, what do I have next? Carly, Melissa G, Cody, thank you guys so much for clicking the follow button. Um, Scott asks, is Ariana staying with Tom? I don't know that. I have no idea what that living situation is like. I know they both own that house. Um, who knows? Nicole asks, will Ariana come back to Instagram? We miss her. She should come back to Instagram. 
But you know what? I know that feeling where you just want to disconnect. You're like, I can't take it. I just want to feel like I'm off the grid. So she's got a really great support team behind her. I know that there's like a group chat with people who are saying like who's coming and going and at what times. Um, I check in with her, obviously. I feel like we're friends, but we haven't been super close for a while. Um, and I think I'm a little abrupt for her right now. You know, I'm very intense and... I don't know that that's the headspace that she's in quite yet. I think I may be benef more beneficial when more time has passed. Because me, I like, I can only relate to this in the sense that she, it was a friend of hers, which I cannot even imagine. But with my situation, you know, I was fully activated. I was like, oh, 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 grenade launchers are ready. <laughs> All right, we're ready. I don't think, I don't know where her head's, I don't think her head space is there quite yet. Um, how did Sheena deal with the news since she was with Raquel when stuff hit the fan? Um, she's going through it. It's very hard when you trust people like that. And you'll, you start thinking about people differently. You really do. That's how I just, I feel for everybody involved well except for those two i don't feel for them at all but i never have so this isn't really this just was like you're disgusting but like never liked either of you what's next um layered gold necklace has tom tried to contact anyone i'm sure they have i'm not here's the thing this whole thing that happened like we're talking about two people who I did not ever really dig. So I'm on the outskirts. Don't you feel that way? Absolutely. I'm kind of on the fringe. The rest of my cast members, they're all kind of intertwined with certain people. Like even Tom Schwartz and I, everything after he went and hung out with my ex and all of that. Like I kept him at a distance. I feel like for me, I am completely on the fringe of all of this because I never liked either one of them. So... I'm just sitting over here like, this is horrible. If anyone needs me, this is where I'll be. But I don't feel like I'm in it like the rest of the group. So there's that. Um, Stephanie asks, do you think the Sandoval and Bambi will be together? Don't know. Don't cur. <laughs> um, Sienna asks, uh, sorry. Do you think Schwartz was in on it providing a distraction with the whole make out thing? Um, you guys are going to see my feelings this season before we picked cameras back up. You're going to see exactly how I felt. <laughs> that was me. Something ain't right. Something ain't right. Amazon customer asks, when did Schwartz find out? I've heard a bunch of different things. I feel like I'm kind of with you guys. I'm just reading things. Again, I'm on the fringe. Um, Shelby says, oh, please don't disengage from the ground. <laughs> See, mom, I'm the bright light at the end of the tunnel for all this. I'm bringing the comedic, the comedic aspect that everyone needs. Uh, right? Yes. Send it to Daryl. <laughs> Where's my cut? <laughs> See, my mama laughs at everything I say. That's why when I'm around people and they're like, she's not funny. I'm like, What? <laughs> My mom thinks I'm hysterical. <laughs> Ashley, my friend lives in Raquel's building and they were filming Sunday. She thinks Sandoval was there. Wow, look at Ashley spilling the tea. Look at Ashley spilling the tea. Didn't come for me, bravo. Ashley said it. <laughs> Ashley said it. Not me. Email her. What do I have next, Bill? You have... Let me talk to my friends for a sec. Okay. Samantha says, gotta be real. I, for one, am really hoping Bravo fires those two and Schwartz. I think we are all ready and willing, and the show would be amazing with you girls. And bring back Kristen. What do you think? You know what, Samantha? I, I never would wish anyone to be fired. I will say, um, I do like all female casts. I don't... 
Like, I feel like every season, Tom Sandoval wants to go toes with me. And I'm like, why am I arguing with a grown man again? I have yet to see any of the dudes on the show that, on the show now, go at it. It's like, I feel like I'm constantly battling men on this show. And it's, I'm a little over it. And I think now we can all see there's... The Toms have triggered me for a while. I've always thought, like, Schwartz is really sweet, but I feel like he's weak as it gets. Never liked Raquel. Never liked Tom Sandoval. And everyone looked at me like I was crazy, okay? And I was kind of put on the outskirts because of it. It was like, she doesn't get along, and they're our best friends. And now look where we are. Am I like Ocean? I'll ask Ocean a question, and if she doesn't know, she goes. <laughs> <laughs> so stinking cute. Okay. Oh, this person's shady. This person, Scott, says, Tom makes Jax look good. Yeah. I love that. Monica says, just tuned in. Did I miss the tea? No, Monica, you didn't miss the tea because we've been given strict instructions to not spill any tea. So I'm just spilling anything that is my opinion. Right? Which I think we all already know. All right. The last two things that I have, I think, on Amazon Live. I appreciate it. Um, Carrie asks, I want to know what Ariana is going to do about her half of the price of the home because Tom borrowed. That is all stuff that you're, I'm sure, going to have answers to when the rest of season 10 airs or in the reunion. None of this. <laughs> <laughs> There's, if there's another dog. Yeah. Lily, Lily, calm down, my love. I'm sorry, guys. Lily, you're okay. It's okay. Um, have you talked to LVP? I can't wait to see her on Watch What Happens Live. I have not talked to her. I think she's got a lot going on right now. You know, she's kind of the glue that holds the group together, and I'm sure she's very upset about all of this. I think we all are. I mean, I've had a hard time sleeping at night. Yeah. Like, my mind feels fried, and I don't know if you guys can tell on this Amazon Live, if you've tuned in before, we always have a great time, but this has made a lot of us very foggy. Like, I definitely wake up a lot in the middle of the night going, what is going on? It's just like an icky, it's an icky feeling. Um, Grace asked, do you genuinely think there's any coming back from this for Rachel and Sandoval? I personally do not. I think these, this is a character flaw, but I, I don't know. I have no idea. Um, Amazon customer has Raquel lost her job at sir. I don't know. I'm sure mom, my mom. <laughs> oh my gosh. Every time I ask a question, she goes like this. <laughs> Out of the corner I'm of my eye. The dog. No, he's looking at you're, she's looking dead at me. You're going like this. I'm looking at you're looking at me, I can see you. Okay. It's the me, it's the meme. It is the meme. Are you trying to tell me what to tell them? Is that what you're doing? I feel like she's a stage one. <laughs> Let's go home and watch Real Housewives of Potomac tonight, yeah? <laughs> also, can I tell you guys one other thing that I think you're messing up on? The San Um, Ashley asked, like, how did they think this would play out? Clearly, no one was thinking. Um, Amazon customer, I showed up late to the Tom and Raquel are over party. What did I miss? A lot. I would just Google it, right? Have they rewatched it? Did I? I don't. Did I give a play by play on here? On Amazon Live? Yeah. She did it again. <laughs> she did it again. Oh my gosh, you're so funny. I cannot. Tanya says, I literally refresh my Instagram for more stories from you. Your Insta stories are amazing. See, Mom? Tanya told me. I am funny. She did it again. <laughs> I cannot. All right. I love you guys so much. Thank you for bearing with me on this amazing Amazon Live. Um, make sure, again, you click the follow button. You'll be made aware anytime I go live on Amazon. I hope you enjoyed the goods, and I will catch you next time.